Hello, happy Earth Day. Um, I decided to read a book called Compost Stew, an A to Z recipe for the earth. Perfect day to talk about composting. Last year on Earth Day, we went and looked at our compost pile at school and really talked about what was happening with it and um, why it was so important. Um, this is also a fun book, um, kind of just focusing on different things you can put in your compost that start with each letter of the alphabet. Compost Stew by Mary McKenna Siddles. Environmental chefs, here's a recipe for you to fix from scratch to mix a batch of compost stew. Ingredients. Apple cores, bananas bruised, coffee grounds with filters used. Dirt clods crumbled, eggshells crushed, fruit pulp left behind, all mushed. Grass clippings, hair snippings, and an insect or two. Just add to the pot and let it all rot into compost stew. Save jack-o'-lanterns, kitchen scraps, laundry lint from dryer traps. Mulch removed from garden beds, nutshells, oatmeal, paper shreds. Quarry dust, rye bread crust, and seaweed strands, a few. Just add to the pot and let it all rot into compost stew. Take tea bags plucked from long, hot swimmings, underbrush prunings, vegetable trimmings, wiggly worms with compost cravings, Christmas tree needles, yellow pine shavings. And zinnia heads from flower beds whose blooming days are through. Just add to the pot and let it all rot into compost stew. Moisten, toss lightly, cover, let brew. And when the cooking is complete, Mother Earth will have a treat. Dark and crumbly, rich and sweet. Now open the pot and what have you got? Compost stew. Yeah. And I hope that gave you some ideas of things that you can compost. Maybe you didn't know that you could compost some of these items. Um, and maybe try to remember what we talked about last year if you were in our class about why compost is so, so important. Maybe do a re little research today on what's happening with the compost. And I hope you enjoyed this book and really take a moment today to appreciate Mother Earth and think of ways we can help Mother Earth because she helps us every day. Thank you.